be the preacher, would you be my? What's the done, the done, done? I still got a lot of shit to learn, I'll admit it. What's going on you guys? Welcome back to another video here on the channel. It is your boy Zach Plays AN and today we're going to be showing off something that a lot of people don't even know exists. This is an armor set that can be quite overpowered once it is used the correct way and honestly I'm not even sure if I know that right way yet. But we're going to be taking a look at it today. We're going to be looking into crystal fragments you guys. Crystal fragments were added in the new end update and uh, they look pretty exciting. At first when you right click it you can see the recipes. Um, originally I just saw the catalyst and I was like, okay, yeah, that's pretty cool. Increases the number of resources created by this generator slash minion by three times for three hours. So that means, let's say, well, like, let's say a minion makes a stack of diamonds every hour and three stacks over that hour. Over that hour time, it would instead make nine stacks, which is quite ridiculous. But there is also crystal armor. This stuff is ridiculously OP when it comes to mana, uh, defense and, um, health can be fixed a little bit by getting growth and protection on them but overall this is a mana armor set if you need mana for something this is the set you use you could probably beat the 48 second uh race in the end island with this very set on so anyways i'm gonna be showing you guys how to get your hands on we're gonna be showing off the set in general and uh if you guys are excited for today's episode make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here we just hit 16.8k subscribers at the time of recording this and we should be hitting 17K the day you guys are watching this. So thank you so much for the support. And I know 88% of you guys aren't subscribed. It went up, but we went up in subs. I'm so confused. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for all the support. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here. And uh, let's get into today's episode. It's going to be a good one. Before I, I go ahead and show you guys how to actually get your hands on crystal fragments so you guys can craft this armor, shout out to all these legends in the tab uh, for just chilling out on the island. Seriously, I logged on, and the second I logged on, they all came flooding, and uh, a couple of you guys have left, but thank you so much. Uh, can you shout my YouTube lol? Sorry, bro, but yeah, uh, shout out to all these guys for just hanging out here on the island, and this guy's just flexing on us with his emerald set, and uh, yeah, thanks for uh, visiting the island and being supportive. I love it, you guys. Also, one last thing before we go over to the island, huge shout out to my man Meeks right here. He gave us four of these crystal fragments so we can actually go ahead and craft the helmet. And I'm also getting my hands on the chest plate, pants, and boots, hopefully, hopefully. And uh, so stay tuned for that part of the video. But huge shout out to him for even showing me about the crystal armor. Link to his YouTube channel will be in the description down below. This beautiful boy just hit 10k subs on YouTube, so go and show him some love over there. And he's been uploading amazing content. So just wanted to say that and get that out of the way. Um, but absolutely love this man like the work that he's been putting into his channel has been unreal too So go ahead and show him some love and tell him that your boy sent him and he's anyways uh, Let's go to the end right now you guys So here we are in the end I'm gonna show you guys how to actually get this armor set and this armor set is very interesting the brighter it is the more um, Mana that you receive so right now as you can see my man is at 767 and the brighter it gets the higher it goes the darker it gets it get, becomes a darker color and as it gets brighter it becomes brighter and so forth it is super cool the armor changes colors with the actual oh there's a runic guy there's a runic oh they killed him okay that's guys nice. oh okay this armor set cannot take a bunch of hits but it does have tons of mana and uh how you actually go about getting this thing is here in the end and now i'm scared that i'm going to die so ah <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have an idea. We're gonna drop down in our uh, Ender set slash Titanic uh, thing thingy, and hopefully not die. Okay, nineteen health. Oh, that's <laughs> oh jeez, you guys, that is ridiculous. I do I didn't look at anybody. Okay, we have eight hundred ninety-two health though, so we should just be able to plop, plop. And plop now. There we go. Okay, now we are finally down at the bottom. So uh, there was a big change that was actually added before when you would go and try and get a summoning eye here in the end fortress, you would see them holding a summoning eye in their hand or an ender chest. And these ender chests would drop these crystal fragments that are used to actually craft this gorgeous armor set. The thing is, they changed it so that now every single Z lot is not holding something and you have a chance of getting a summoning eye or uh, crystal fragments from every single Z lot that you kill so you never know which one is actually going to be the money one Which one's going to give you all the the cool stuff obviously and that guy just absolutely destroyed the one that we were going after I, I want to know what's on this man's sword 
if I'm being honest. And uh, so yeah, you never know which one's actually gonna drop the stuff that you want. So it is a little confusing in that aspect, but it is really cool nonetheless. I think it's really cool that they made that change. And crystal fragments aren't that hard to get. They are an epic item, as you can see. And uh, they are used once you have 24 of them. Oh, okay, buddy. Yeah, that. Um, <laughs> once you have 24 of them, you can actually go about crafting this crystal set. And uh, it's quite simple. So, like, if we look at the recipes here, you can also craft a catalyst, which I was explaining earlier. And then we have the crystal set, as you can see right here. Once you have 24 of them, you can craft this armor set. And it has a base intelligence that is also really high as well. But the lighter it is, the more intelligence you are actually going to have. So I want to test this out. I want to see if we can actually basically fly through the air and finally beat this race in 48 seconds with this armor set on. We have tons of mana and it should be somewhat possible. So uh, let's go. Let's go uh, fly through the air here. Oh, man. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Oh. oh, no, we died from fall damage. I didn't think that we would die from fall damage. I just realized how high up we actually were, though. But it's looking possible. It really is. And so we're going to go back to our island because on our island, once we throw this set on for a second, our mana will skyrocket up to 980. So let's let heal up for a second and uh, it will skyrocket. You guys are insane, by the way, for just posting up on the island. So let's get, let me get up to 980 and then we'll go back and try this thing again. So as you can see, now it has reached 980. Let's take this thing off and we will throw on our uh, actually decent set that can hopefully take a hit, but we should stay at, oh, uh, it really reset us, eh? It's gonna do us dirty like that. Okay, I guess we need to charge up with this thing in the brightest spot that we can. So we need to go into this area. And with a mana 5 potion, you would have well over a thousand. And we're going to test that out on the island, actually. So here we should get 819. This shouldn't take too large to charge up. But the amount of mana you get with this thing is quite absurd. And so as I was talking about in yesterday's video, the Endstone Sword, you would be able to deal tons of damage. I'm pretty sure you can do almost up to 37 million damage maxed out with the most of everything that you can get in the game so far and that's what someone commented on the last one so i haven't fact checked that but from what i've heard that is accurate so that is ridiculous nonetheless but okay we're here we're almost at 800 um and once it gets to 800 then i'll just swap out the armor there we go 819 now let's put on our actually good set here there we go and hopefully we do not die in the air this time that is the plan um i need Feather boots. This, these ones have... Oh, these ones don't have feather falling. That's why. That's why we're taking so much damage, I was going to say. But hopefully we do not die this time. I'm going to try this one more time. But it is doable to beat the race with this. So that is uh, all I can really say there. Ooh, no. Okay. Eh, that's not a good start. Not a good start at all. Oh, come on. Okay, here we go. And now we're over here with 22 seconds in. Okay, we might die on our way back down though. So, I don't know. It's going to be really close. I don't think we're going to make it because we, uh, we need more health and stuff. But nonetheless, it is doable with this. From what I... What? Oh, it just lagged. It just lagged. Ah! Okay, but you guys get the point basically. And uh, it, the amount of mana you have, you can absolutely soar across the sky with the aspect of the ends. And once you have uh, spider boots, you can double jump in between and definitely make that done. But let's go back to our island and use a mana 5 potion and see how much mana we can actually get wearing this armor set. So we are back on the island and right now our mana is recharging. And shout out to all these people for absolutely being legends and just hanging out on the island. You guys are amazing people. And, uh, oh, okay, yeah, it picked up. There we go. And so instantly grants plus 50 mana, allowing you to exceed the mana cap. So... We are going to, well, we're going to be over a thousand mana, which is going to be quite absurd and uh, something that I have not done before, but I mean, it's going to be pretty interesting. Like if we look at our stats right now, intelligence 880, that is uh, quite ridiculous and let's let it load properly. I'm getting a couple leg spikes right now. My ping is looking a little low, but yeah, as you can see, 880 intelligence as it says, but we're actually at 980 and if we drink this, hopefully it doesn't lag. Okay, it's lagging but 1130 mana that is absurd and uh probably the most that i've personally ever seen and uh yeah i'm gonna let them know i have over 1000 mana right now 
That is unreal, you guys. That is insane. Uh, crazy numbers. 1,000 mana. You can launch yourself, like, wherever you want, really. Boom, boom, boom. Like, how far should we go? Like, I don't know. Boom, boom. <laughs> like, look at this. Like, we're just soaring around, and it's recharging so quickly. Like, we could honestly probably sustain flight for a good while. I mean, obviously, this is going down because we are doing two. But, like... Like, still, this is ridiculous. Like, we're just flying around right now. Like, we have not touched the ground in a while here. And it's all because of our mana situation. And let's try and touch down. We're going to die. Yeah, we died. <laughs> but that is still ridiculous how long we could just soar, a lo soar around for. So that is super handy. Let's say you're about to die and you kind of just need to launch yourself up in the air and not be touched. Or if you just feel like traveling in style. There's a really cool armor set that I recommend uh, looking into. As you can see, it is super bright when you have uh, the most light. Like current light level is 15, which means 200% mana on whatever the armor has. And so this is with the smart. And once, uh, if you were to have wise on this, for example, the wise reforge, it would be even higher. So really cool armor set that I wanted to show off for today's episode. Let me know what you guys think of this in the comment section down below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here. And leave a like if you guys did enjoy today's guide slash tutorial here on Hypixel Skyblock. I think it was a really cool one. Comment what you guys want to see in the next one, and I hope to see you guys in tomorrow's video. See you guys there. Bye.